Good morning. We are, our scripture reading this morning comes from 2 Samuel chapter 1, verse 25 to chapter 2, verse 2. <clears throat> the brave soldiers have fallen. They were killed in battle. Jonathan lies dead in the hills. I grieve for you, my brother Jonathan. How dear you were to me. How wonderful was your love for me. Better than even the love of women. The brave soldiers have fallen. Their weapons abandoned and useless. After this, David asked the Lord, Shall I go and take control of one of the towns of Judah? Yes, the Lord answered. Which one? David asked. Hebron, the Lord said. So David went to Hebron. Brothers and sisters, every year the artillery corps assembles to face reality. The reality is that soldiers do die. And normally, normally those who die are young men and women. We gather here to sing a lament. That is a song of grief about our fallen comrades in arms. In the passage we read, David does exactly the same. He cried about his brother Jonathan, who fell in battle. And David sings a lament. Verse 25 to 26. Jonathan lies dead in the hills. I grieve for you, my brother. How dear you were to me. How wonderful was your love for me. Better even than the love of women. This camaraderie and love is common among soldiers, brothers in arms depending on one another, loving one another, fighting with one another, now grieving the loss of a fellow soldier. That is why we gather here every year. David's song also sings about Jonathan's, Jonathan's braveness. Only now in death, his weapons lay abandoned and useless. Up till this, his death, his weapons were in, the, in his hands and he was facing the enemy. A soldier facing the enemy by the time of his death is always honored. But what do soldiers do after they grieved the fallen? And that's this we read in 2 Samuel 2 verse 1 to 2. After this, David asked the Lord, Shall I go and take control of one of the towns of Judah? Yes, the Lord answered. Which one? David asked. Hebron, the Lord said. So David went to Hebron. After soldiers grieved their fallen, they pick up their weapons and they go on with their task. What I like about David here is that he first con consulted God. Must I go, Lord? And the Lord said, yes. And where must I go? Consulting God. Making sure that our plans is in line with God's plans, plans is what makes us successful in our task. May God always comfort us. May God always be our guide. May God always protect us. May God always give us success. To Him be the glory forevermore. We will now sing the hymn, Abide With Me.
Let us pray. Our Father in heaven, we bow before you as our God. We praise you for your presence with us in the task you called us for. Please comfort us as we mourn our dead. Please guide us as we go from here and protect us while we fulfill our task. May we accomplish the goals that were set before us. And now, brothers and sisters, may the Lord bless you and take care of you. May the Lord be kind and gracious to you. May the Lord look on, on you with favor and give you peace. Amen. Fellow Gunners, esteemed friends, I trust that you are doing well during this time of restraint. I hope you and your loved ones are safe. Today we should have been in Potchefstroom at the Gunners Memorial Monument. We wanted to be there to participate in the annual National Gunners Memorial Service Parade and in the wreath laying ceremony. But like so many other events, it had to be cancelled due to the worldwide coronavirus pandemic. The Gunner Fraternity and their friends have gathered at the memorial annually for the past 68 years. We did that to pay tribute and honour those South African gunners who died serving our country. This is the first year since its consecration in 1952 that it cannot happen. However, in true gunner spirit, we are maintaining our aim to again this year pay homage to those gunner comrades who sacrificed their lives for us. Let us therefore pause and reflect Although we cannot do it together, on the ultimate price our fallen gunner heroes paid so that we may live in peace and harmony, seeking a good life for ourselves. We are blessed and grateful that I can inform you that we did not have any fatalities due to operations or training since we were gathered at the memorial in April 2019. Nine hundred and eighty-four gunners' names are recorded on our roll of honour and engraved on the granite plaques of the memorial. Their deaths, their sacrifices, and the battles they fought have shaped us. As time passes, our respect and reverence for what they did grows even stronger. We honor their memory. went with songs to the battle. They were young, straight of limb, true of eye, steady and aglow. They were staunch to the end against odds uncounted. They fell with their faces to the foe. They shall not grow old 
as we that are left grow old. Age shall not weary them, nor the years condemn. At the going down of the sun, and in the morning, we will remember them. Countries, please
National salute! Prison! This is the first time since the consecration in 1952 of the Gunners Memorial in Potchefstroom that the annual memorial service has not taken place. The first time in 68 years. This memorial service has become the event in the Gunners calendar and has received compliments from domestic and foreign dignitaries from around the world. The numbers have been steadily growing with last year's memorial topping an attendance of 700 plus. The unprecedented situation we find ourselves in has necessitated the unfortunate cancellation of this year's memorial. To ensure that we remember those gunners who paid the ultimate price in service of their country, it was decided to hold a virtual service to remember our fallen heroes. Thank you for sharing the celebration of the memory of our saddest but proudest possession, 
our Roll of Honour. We will remember them. I'd like to convey a special thank you to the Formation Sergeant Major, Chief Warrant Officer Jacques Nimont, for making this virtual event possible, and Gunnar Albert Pastana for editing the material and putting the video clip together, as well as all of those that have actually provided input. Stay positive, stay safe, Ubiquit.